Good morning, everyone. This is Todd Creecock back for another exciting day here on the Ark Survival Evolved Volgaro map. This is day 484 of my little adventure. Well, and well, I've not got nothing in my inventory except these recipes for focal chili and mine white tonic because today I'm going to try to do some crafting skills on some Spinosaur saddles. I've been planning on doing this for a long time. I've emptied out my inventory completely except for the recipes and a little bit of food to eat because I'm going to lose all my weight. I'm going to re respec all my Ingram points into crafting skills and I'm at level, I think I'm at level 103 right now. So that should put me really high on the crafting skills and I'm going to take a mind wipe tonic and a focal chili and I'm going to start crafting stuff. I've got materials and all these Argentavises to craft up 16 Spinosaur saddles and I've got a Mastercraft blueprint. I've also got uh, a better shotgun blueprint in there. I'm going to try to craft and skill that. I've got a better long neck over there and a smithy that I'm going to try to get in better stats on. And I've also got some armor that I'm going to try to get better stats on. So I'm going to, first thing I've got to do is make up these make up these recipes. I've already put most of the stuff I need for the recipes in my cooker here. And let's go ahead and do the focal chili first, I think. It takes three servings of cooked meats, centronol, handful of all the berries, and just water. So I've got everything in there now I need except for the cooked meat. So let's get some cooked meat sticking there, see if we can make up some focal chili. Don't know if the focal chili really works or not. But I've heard it helps a lot on the crafting skill thing. So I'm going to make up some of that. I hope this recipe is correct. If it is, I start, uh -oh, I'm making something else. There is a focal chili, but what else am I making here? Making energy brews. Why am I making this other stuff? I've got something in here that shouldn't be in here. Three focal chilies. I don't know if I need very many of them anyway, though. I think I've messed up something here. I've put this extra ingredients in here that I want to use for the mind wipe tonics. And it's using them for something else. It's making up these energy brews and stuff, so it's burning up all of my... All my red berries. I've got to get some more red berries in here. And probably some more blue ones. I should not have had that stuff in there for that other... For the mind wipe tonic already. Because that's messing up my... And I'm out of blueberries also. Let's go grab some more blueberries. It's cooking those up before I can do anything. Yep, I didn't figure this out properly. I've probably got enough focal chili already, though. Let's put a few more of these in here. Get their stuff out of there, and we'll start cooking up the mind wipe tonic here in a minute. I've never done crafting skill on anything before, so I don't know how it'll do exactly. I reckon it is supposed to give you better. Wow. Okay, what's causing this? I don't know, but I'm going to stop it. I'm going to stop it because I'm getting stuff I don't want out of there. And I run all my berries out that I was using for other stuff, so I've got to go get more berries now. But I've got three focal chilies, so I guess that's pretty good. Let's see. Put this meat up. Trying to keep my inventory cleaned out because I don't want to. Don't want to get overweight once I get this thing started. Okay, I made up some energy brews and some this Kellyan Kellyan soup. What does that do? Vegetable dish it refreshes your body like an oasis. Oh, I guess it gives you water. And I did already have a few focal chilies already. So I've got five. I, 
one's probably all I'm really going to need. Put my lemons up. I've got to go get some more berries to make this mine drop tonic. See what it takes right quick here. It takes eight servings of cooked prime meat, 20 handfuls of mayhew berries. It looks like it takes a lot of mayhew berries. So actually it doesn't take all those other berries like I thought. So just get a whole bunch of mayhew berries. And it takes what else? Stimulant, rare mushroom for our flowers, narcotics, and cooked prime meat. I should have all that stuff. Let's get this cooked up and get started on our crafting today. I'm fixing to respec all my Ingram points into crafting, so it's going to be crazy. Hopefully this is enough. I've already got the rare mushrooms and rare flowers in there. Narcotics and stimulant. Turn it down and see what we get. Hopefully some mind wipe tonics. I'm not forgetting anything. Yep, there's one. Don't know how many of these I should make. I'm just going to let it run until it stops, I think. I think it may have already stopped. What am I out of? Wow, it's just taking a ton of stimulant and narcotics, ain't it? I'm going to make another or two just for for the looks of it, or for the, might use it up later. But I had two stacks of each of these in there. Had two stacks of narcotics and stimulant in there, and it used up almost all of it, so it must take a lot to make these things. give us any more or we ain't got enough berries. I think we don't have enough berries. Wow, that's crazy. Can't believe it takes that much. It takes a ton of mayhew berries. Now what am I missing? Okay, there's a third one. Is there enough in there to make another one? I kind of doubt it. I think we're going to have to stop at four because that took a lot more materials than I thought it would. Let's get all that stuff out of there. And I've got to put all this stuff up before I do anything else today. Before I get the mind wipe thing going. Okay, I'm gonna keep my mayhew berries in there. Boy, that used up about all I had. I think I had about 600 in here. And that reminds me, I might as well make these up while I've got stuff going here. Used up quite a bit of cooked prime meat also, but not near as much as near as much as it did of berries and uh, stimulant and stuff. Make up extras of all that. I seen an egg I did indeed. I'm going to have to quit doing busy work if I'm going to get this done. Let's get with it. Rare flowers and mushrooms I need to stick back in a fridge. And I need to take this mind wipe tonic and reset all my points. Which one of these has the flowers and mushrooms? Let's not be that one. And yep, four of them took like 80 of each of those.
we're fixing to start doing some crafting and see how well this turns out for us. We don't really know what to do yet. Get in there, berries. Okay, I need to get me a focal chili. And I need to pet my lystro. Don't know if that'll matter right now or not, but let's go ahead and do this. Okay, we're completely respect now. We'll see how high we can get our crafting skill. All our other stats are back down to 100 even, so we won't be able to carry anything. We'll just have to do everything right out of it. We just hit a thousand percent crafting skill. Eleven hundred and twenty crafting skill at level one hundred three. I'm gonna take a focal chili. It says twenty three hours before I can take another mind wipe tonic, so I'm gonna be able not able to do anything for twenty three hours on here. Twenty three hours and fifty nine minutes. Hmm. I did know that actually. So I'm not going to be able to go out and do no exploring and stuff for a while. And I've got 870-something seconds on this. So let's get to crafting. Did I pet my Lystro? we got the buffs going here. So we're going to be crafting some very high-level items. I'm going to start off with a shotgun here, I think. And we need a bunch of polymer for this. It takes 649 polymer, and we do have a bunch and our snail here that we went down into the aberration area and killed a bunch of carcanos for this. Question is, is I cannot carry this much stuff, can I? Don't believe I can. How much can I carry? Wow, I can't carry nothing. I have to make three trips over here just to transport this stuff. That's bad. I may have to bring an Argentavis or something over here to move that stuff with. And I'm going to have a hard time having enough spots in here too, looks like. I do have enough for that. So let's go ahead and turn this on and craft it. See how this comes out. We want a really high level shotgun here. It's basically it's a 201. So I'm hoping for 230 or something maybe. Two thirty-two, okay that's pretty good. I don't know how you tell it got Craft a skill extra 30 points. That's great. That's the best shotgun by far I've got. Let's craft up some of these flippers also. And a mask. And I would like to craft up another one of those swimming fans, but I don't think I have enough polymer to do that with. Let's put all our polymer in there and see what we can do. Wow, I cannot carry that. Come on, let me carry this much. Just barely. Yep, this ain't going to be enough. I'd really like to craft it instead of that nice swimming gear there, but I'm not going to be able to do that. Going to be close, though. Let's see, what can I do? Oh, I like about 200 polymers, so I can't do that. Got some Mastercraft swimming fans with 33. That didn't change a thing on those, did it? I don't think it did. Goggles have 66 
or 65 hypothermic insulation. Well, that went up on the goggles, but it didn't go up on the... Oh, because I only got 2.7% on the swim fence, so they came out really bad. My goggles came out with 17% extra. My tank came out with 32% extra. Wow, that is a good tank. Can I make another one of those? Need some metal ingots. And I need cotton if I want to make more of those. Let's make some more of those. If I can transfer. If I can transfer metal from here to there. That might be a problem. Do forget to go pet my lastro. Let's go pet the lastro. Grab some cotton and make a, another swim fin because it didn't come out good. Our scuba tank came out really good. I don't know why I'm actually wasting the metal to make another one. I'm not picking that egg up because I won't be able to carry nothing else. Okay, cotton. Here. Probably shouldn't bother making another scuba tank, but that one there came out really good. Okay, we got that going. Let's go make our long neck rifle now. Long neck rifles are really expensive, but I've got enough in this chest right here to make one. Hope I get a good buff on it. Its base level is 219 ascended. So I'm hoping for maybe a 240, maybe. That's probably a lot to ask. 231, it got 10% bonus, and I can't make another one of those because it just takes too much materials. Yep. Let's check the fabricator again. Okay, how did our other scuba tank come out? We got one with 32% and one with 5%. Wow, that was really bad. On our swim fins, we got one with 2% and one with 2%. Well, those can, both came out bad also. Shotgun came out pretty good. It's got 30%. And the mask came out with 17%. I couldn't make another mask. Let's do that. And that's probably about all I'm going to be able to make in the fabricator. Let's go make her black armor and stuff right now while we got this crafting thing going. It's a last turn even pet again. We've got stuff in here to make a crossbow, a pike, and a couple of pieces of good armor. Start with a crossbow. It's 297 base. Really hoping to get a good one with this. Okay, 392. Wow, that came out with 47.7%, that is really good. Okay, I'm gonna make a pike. It's 340, 324 base. How did it come out? 356, not the best, but I don't think I have enough materials to make a second one, so we'll have to just deal with that. We got a 437 flak gauntlets. Oh my God, them things came out with 593 armor. Wow, that is awesome. Let's hope the helmet comes out that good. We might possibly be able to make a couple extra helmets and stuff. It came out with 12%, so not that great, but it's still a lot better than what I had. This crafting skill thing is the way to go. Okay, 362 on those. Those are 42% buffed. Wow. My gauntlets are 46% are, uh, buffed, and they've got an extra, almost a, well, they've got an extra 160 points of damage on them. Wow, that is just great. I'm going to make another helmet, because the one I got on it didn't come out so great. So let's see how this comes out. Let's hope for a 500-plus helmet. 506. Wow, it's still not 
as good as I could do. I don't, I've got any materials left. Oh, a little bit of hide. I can make another one. Let's go get a little bit of hide. Pet the lice trail. You need a pet yet? Not yet. Oh, we're doing really good here. A little bit of hide and we can make another one. If we can get 40-something percent on the helmet, that'll be great. Then we got to start crafting all these saddles. I've got enough for 16 saddles. And I know they'll range from probably 0% all the way up to about 50 probably. Try for another helmet here. Come on, be better this time. We got a 506 already. Work better than 506. Five, 573. I believe that's good enough on the helmet. Wow. And there's. Oh, heck, I could make another crossbow. All I need is fiber. I need a lot of fiber, though. Do I have a, do I have a thousand fiber anywhere? If I do, I'm going to make another crossbow. Because that's just crazy. Do I have a thousand fiber anywhere? I think I do. Oh, yes. Don't much think we'll get a better crossbow than we've already got, but we'll have two really super good ones. Then I can just grind up all these other ones I've got because they ain't nothing compared to this. 392 crossbow, wow. Fixing to try again, too. Hoping for even better. I doubt if I get better than that, though. I got a 307. Yeah, that one wasn't quite as good. And really no way I can make anything else, I don't think. I could make another helmet. Let's make another pair of pants. I could definitely use better of those. I got a 362, which is a pretty high, pretty high percentage. I think I'm done with this one. Pet the last trail again. We need to get the level up buffs going too. Okay, what do we need to do now? We need to get started on those saddles. We need to see how our Spinosaurus saddles are going to come out. We've only got enough stuff to make 16 of them though, and we're going to we're going to do the boss battle pretty soon. So we need to. We needed 20 of them, actually, but it just takes so much hide to make these things that I just figured I was going to go ahead and do it. I'll probably do the Gamma Boss with just 16 spinos. What did we get here? We got a 90 armor saddle out of a 63 armor saddle. That is a that is a 48% buff on that saddle. Wow. Let's go again. Need more of those. Level 90 saddle is wow. I think we can make three in this. I think I've got enough stuff in here to make three saddles. Is it going is the question. Yep, we've got three more saddles going here. The 70 armor, that's terrible. That's going to be the worst one, I hope. That and only got 2% bonus on it. Let's give me a 100 saddle. I want to see a 100 saddle. Probably not going to be able to get that high, I don't think. I've got an 85 and an 86. So 90 is probably going to be about as high as I can get off of these. But let's get them crafted up and see real quick. This is crazy good. The worst part is I'm going to have to wait 24 hours before I can respect my character back to normal. There's three more. Let's hope for some higher ones. we got a level 90 saddle already, 90 armor saddle. Hope for some a little better than that. There's a 75. Well, that ain't good at all. That's a little bit of a buff, but not great. Come on, 90 plus. 80 not coming out great. 
I guess 80 is pretty good. It's a 26% bonus. And we got an 85. So we're basically getting anywhere from 70 to 90 on these. I can't put them all together to compare them because I can't carry them. But this is how you craft and skill stuff. I think I'm going to go make sure the Lystro is still painted. I don't know if I can even make anything else. Yeah, Lystro is still good. I'm, this is taking every bit of the materials I've got. It took me forever to get enough hide for these saddles. There's an 80 and an 84. Looks like that 90 one's probably going to be my best. Yep, it's looking like it. Because the highest one in that is 84. It's got a 35% buff on it. I think this is going to be about the last one I can do here. This should give me 16 saddles. I can scoop all my materials back up and stick in another chi another thing and see if I can come up with enough to make anything else, but I kind of doubt it. 77. I'd like to see what I'm doing here. 77, 72, and 7. Oh, that was that was bad. I was hoping for more. I'm gonna gather all my materials up here and transfer them into the, one of those smithies and see if I've got anywhere near close to enough to make another one. I really don't think I can. These came out from 72 up to 77, so these were the worst of the bunch. M3. This hasn't been done yet, so I've got three more shots here. I thought I'd done them all. Three more saddles coming up. It is definitely best to put these in the Argentavis and craft them because you can only get enough materials for one inside of a smithy. I got enough in the Argentavis to make three. So you've got a lot more slots in the Argentavis than you do in a smithy. Very good idea for this. Come on, move up so I can see what we got here. Did we get anything above 90? Nope, 88 the highest one. 82 to 88. It's not great, but it's still better than that last three. We're just going to have to do with what we got here. We've got saddles ranging from 70 up to 90. 16 of them. I'm going to, like I said, I'm going to collect all the materials out of these and see if there's any chance that I've got enough to craft another one. I'm pretty sure I don't, because it takes like 5,000. 5,000 hide. These range from 80.1 to 84.9. These, there's a lot of fiber left in this one. Probably got enough fiber and everything except for hide to make another one. Okay, the three in this Argentavis went from 75.3 up to 85.7. I'm going to go ahead and dump all this stuff into a smithy here. See how far off I am. I need this stuff back, though. This is the best saddle. The first one I made was a 90.6. And I just need a ton of stuff. I can come up with everything but the hide, but I can't get enough hide, so I can't make another one. I'm going to be stuck at 16. These here range from 75 to 85. And the one in this one went from 70.2, which is the worst one I got. Come on, transfer the stuff. Seventy point two up to eighty six point eight. 
I see that my my focal chili has worn off already. Put this egg up, and I'm going to check my resources really quick and see if there's any way I can make another one. I'm going to take the hide out of everything I've got and see what I've got enough to make another one. I don't think I do. But this focal chili is going to last for 20, or the mine white tonic thing is going to last for 24 hours. So I guess I could take my wyvern out and do some more hide hunting and probably make up a few more saddles. It's going to be really tough to do, though. There's a little bit of hide. Boy, I've got some really good flak now. Yep, really good stuff in there. I've got 500 plus armor helmet and stuff. Let's see, do I have any hide left in here? Got a little bit. This thing is still running, ain't it? Turn this off. I really need to transfer all that polymer back into my snail so it'll last a little bit longer. I've got stuff in this one here I can transfer over. Do that, and that'll be everything but the hide. Okay, now if I had 5,000 hide, I could make one more. It's pretty bad. So I'm not going to be doing that, not anytime soon anyway. I'm going to lighten this up so it'll be room to put it in there if I do get it. So that's what I might do tomorrow. I might get out and get out and collect some hides. And make another saddle. I probably won't be able to make but one more. Yep. Put all this stuff back in here. Let's look around through these chests and see if I've got any more hide. I might possibly have a little bit more somewhere. Okay, I got it really, well, my long neck really didn't come out all that great. It only came out with 10% bonus, but there's a piece of hide. Yep, my long neck didn't come out that great. I think I got some hide in one of these. Nope, just fiber, apparently. Cement and paste, and this one here's probably got pearls in it. Yep, just ain't going to have the hide to make anything else. There's a few hundred right there, but I need a few thousand. Well, that's probably going to basically wrap up my saddle making day and all my armor and stuff. I do have some ridiculously good armor, though. And I need 4,000 something hide to make another one of these. Okay, what I got is I got a, in this chest right here I got a level 90.6 saddle so those mastercraft saddles started out at 69.9 I think and I got saddles all the way from 70 point something 70.2 up to 90 point something so it's a pretty good range on them and I got a long neck rifle over here which has just got a small buff on it it's a 231 ascended rifle but my best one before was a 219 so that's an improvement and then I made up a shotgun over here in the fabricator and some scuba gear. I could only make one extra shotgun. It came out really good though. It, went, it came out at 232, which my blueprint was a 201. 201 Mastercraft, I think. Yeah, it came out at 232, so it got a 30% buff. Then I made some scuba flippers and stuff. Both of those come out really bad. They got like 2% extra on them, so those were terrible. 
I made two scuba tanks. One of those came out really good, 32%, and this one only came out with 5%, which is, I'm assuming, changes their durability. This one's got 174 durability. This one's got 208 durability, which means that you can stay underwater a lot longer. And the hypothermic insulation is better on it also, which went up to 185.3 from the base of 149. My glasses, I guess the only thing they're good for, well yeah, they got better durability and better insulation on them both. So yeah, you get some buffs on the scuba glasses also. And then probably the best stuff I made is over here in this other smithy. Had really good luck with some of this stuff. I crafted me up a new crossbow. I got a 392 crossbow out of a 297 blueprint, so that's almost 100 extra points of damage on a crossbow. It has got a 47% increase on its damage. Then I made a second one, and it just barely came out better than the original. Then I made some flat gauntlets out of a 437 blueprint. I got a 593 pair of gauntlets, so that's a 46% increase. Boy, these are good. 15% didn't want to increase their hypothermic insulation and stuff. It did just a little bit and increased the durability quite a bit too. Went to 700 on durability and it was 538 from the original blueprint. And I made a bunch of these ascended helmets. I had a 429 ascended helmet blueprint and I got a 471 a 573 and a 506 so the 573 is by far the best one wonder if it increased durability and stuff too yep slightly hypothermic insulation a little bit better but anyway the helmet got a 43 percent boost my flak pants i only had a 284 blueprint on it so it wasn't the best but I made two pairs of flak pants and they came out uh, 358 and a 362.5, so it still came out pretty good. I've got over 300 flak pants now. And then I also made me another pack. It came out from a 324 blueprint, it came out to 356. So it got about, it got a 13% buff, which really wasn't that good. I, I could possibly make another one of these. Do I have any wood anywhere? Let's see if I can make me a better pack. I might still have enough stuff left to do this. E wood might be a problem. It would be good if I could get a better pack. How much wood do I need here? I need 455 wood, so I need 200 more wood in here. I got time to do this before it gets dark. Let's try it. I don't think I can even carry a full stack of wood at one time. Have to make two trips to get the wood in here. Might not even be able to carry a single stack. Yep, I can carry a single stack of wood. Let's get it in there and get this done. We're gonna try one more shot at a pike. Oh, we've still got this crafting skill set up. We would like to have a better one. They'll only be able to do it one time though because I'll only have enough hide for one more. Seems hide is the thing that's the hardest to get. Those saddles took 5,700 hide apiece. And I made 16 of them, so that is a lot of hide. If anybody wants to do the math on that. I'm really going to try to get me one more thing crafted before this is over with. One more pack. Still need a little bit of wood. I need all that hide. I don't know if I got enough hide for the pack or not. If I don't, I won't be doing it. Don't remember, 900 hide is a lot of hide. Get one more stack of wood in there, and then I've got to run and get my hide, craft that up, and I'm going to call it a day because this has been quite a day. It's going to get me closer to the boss fight, though. I think I'm going to try to do it pretty soon now got my saddles. I'm 
Probably going to have to wait at least 24 hours though so I can do a respec on my my levels because I got to put some levels back into health and weight before I go into a boss battle. I'll have to do another mind wipe. Hide, we've got 900 hide. If we don't, I've just been wasting my time. We do. Just barely. It's going to take it all to make one more item. One more item. Let's hope for a really good pike here. I'll probably grind up all the low level stuff after this. Bet the Lystro. Take me another focal chili. I think that might help a little bit. Focal chili does say filling dish full of nu nutritional energy, consume it and gain increased crafting speed. Increased movement speed. Effect class 15 means it says increased speed. It doesn't say nothing about effectiveness though. So it may not help. One more pack. I actually do have enough stuff that I could craft another piece of flak, but I think I came out pretty good on the flax. Let's let's just say we've done good on that and hope we get a really good pack. What did we get? 356. So it came out a little better. Still not the greatest. Yep, still not the greatest, but a 356 is better than a 324. So I guess I'm pretty much done with the crafting for today. Don't think I've got enough stuff to make anything else. Go over and haul this stone to my chemistry bench and turn it into spark powder or cement and paste one another. That's about all I can do now. Wow, I see my ingrams are gone. I see recrafting got rid of all my ingrams. Wow, I didn't know that would happen. Okay. Well... I got some good items. I got some 500 plus armor flak now. And I got a bunch of Spinosaur saddles that range from about 70 armor up to 90 armor. So this day has been pretty successful. I'll be getting prepared for that uh, boss battle pretty soon. I don't know how long it's going to take exactly, but like I said, it's going to take 24 hours before I can redo the mind wipe. But anyway, if you like this video, learn a few things. Please give me a big thumbs up. And thanks again for watching. This is Ty Creek Rock and uh, my level boost in Lystro, Mega Theorem, and Sergeant Fury here signing out.